CubeSat Radiometer RFI Technology Validation Project. Hubert. RFI causes some fraction of the science goals of our current microwave radio emissions to be missed. The problem is only going to continue to get worse. My name is Joel Johnson. I'm a professor of electrical and computer engineering at The Ohio State University. Qbert is kind of a step towards managing that change in the future so that we can continue to do important science observations. Our technology is to try and make it such that our Earth's observing radiometers can still continue to operate in the presence of this radio frequency interference. The subsystem that Qbert will demonstrate is technology you could add on to existing radiometers or, or future radiometers, and by doing so, enable them to continue to operate in the presence of interference. So having the Qbert mission go and be successful will allow us to go to other future radiometer missions, tell them we've got this technology that will be useful for their mission, that will help their mission meet its science goals. The application to Earth science Everyone knows the motivations there in terms of the concerns about the future of Earth's climate. To be able to understand that, we need good Earth-observing systems. Qbert is one piece of the puzzle 